Welcome in everybody. Today I want to talk about a quick little fix that I made for the Hyperkin TurboGrafx-16 controller. I was having issues where playing games, if I was pushing to the left or the right, I would have my character running up or down. And doing some research online, there's a lot of people complaining about it and they think it's a fault in the controller itself. And it kind of is, kind of isn't. It's just the way they designed it. And so I was going to talk really quick about a quick fix I made for it. So the biggest issue is your contacts for your button presses are really, really big. And it makes for a great arcade feel if you're playing a fighter game to be able to get the up and down directional type contacts. But unfortunately, when you're playing most of the games, you just want to go left or right. It causes you to press left and up or left and down. And so using a little bit of thermal tape, I created a cross. As you can see, there's an X across the pads. And I just shrank the area of contact to make it to where there's not so much of the misinterpretation when you're pushing the directions. So when you're putting it across, just make sure that you do make, you know, you do leave room for a good contact and you won't have all the miss button presses. So this is just a quick, cheap, easy fix with a little bit of thermal tape or just regular tape if you have it, just be careful. Uh, electrical tape will be gummy. This stuff won't leave too much of a residue and it's easy to replace and it won't cause any kind of electrical issues, shorting, stuff like that. So there you have it guys, quick, easy fix for the Turbo Graphics controller. Again, I've seen a lot of people with issues online talking about it, but no one's talking about a fix for it. So there you have it, quick and easy guys. Enjoy, happy gaming.